Why is that? Well, it's policy. It's company policy but nothing right now. Happened. Uh, we were told because we're conservative Republicans and they don't like our viewpoints. And that's why we're not Did me. you use a card? I did use a card. Okay, I can refund you, but I can't serve you. Okay, well, I mean, what happened was there, nobody did anything, nobody stole anything, nobody said anything inappropriate, sexually or racially or anything. And now we're being told, and we were told this by a manager at Stone Creek, that we don't like your conservative politics. Okay. So therefore, we're not going to serve you. On my level, as a barista, all I can do is serve you. Okay. All right. I could see if something had happened, but to shun a man based on his political beliefs is just wrong. This is America, man. Imagine if people didn't serve people who voted to the left. People didn't sell them cars or food. It's wrong. So that'll go back in my cart. Okay. Would you like to eat a printer and Ah, sure, why not? Nobody did anything. Okay. I got, I got you. Well, you can imagine where I'm coming from. People are manufacturing stuff to benefit an agenda. And, uh, and it's wrong. My family's been in this neighborhood for eight generations. There's not some kid who moved in here from Madison two years ago. All right, see ya. So, yep, Stone Creek Coffee will not serve you if you are conservative. Here we go. Here we go. He, or, sorry, here we go. I guess let the Google uh, reviews begin. <laughs> what the hell was that? That was insane, dude. What do you, so, so you were right. What, what, what do you think, what do you make of that, Eddie? They're, they're just, they're demonized people. They're demonizing people for, what do you think? Well, like, be, because, like, if you're a conservative at a stone tree, keep your mouth shut. Right. Like, you, or anywhere you know, socially, wearing, I guess. It's wearing Trump shirts, it's doing whatever. Oh, the Trump shirt will get you fucking assaulted or fired or worse. You know, that, that was just next level psychosis. But yeah, Stone Creek Coffee, man. Cannot vibe with that. This isn't like, I shouldn't say this is like statutory. You should have asked like, well, I, you told me that you were all square with Roush and whatnot. Yep, that's what uh, Steve Sobel told me. And he owns all of the Stone Creeks yep. or? Yeah. Huh. That is fucking screwy, man.